take each day as it comes. That was a message that was in Kate's message this week, the Princess of Wales. And it demonstrates what I like to try to talk about, which is speaking and serving. She chose to take a message to video to talk about her nine months of struggling through cancer. And in that message, it was so authentic and so real and also perhaps heartwarming or comforting. And she chose to talk about her struggles in a way that I felt was really moving. And in a message that have come out perhaps from Buckingham Palace on a dreary, drab press release, it was so, so different. And for me, it's been a tricky week. World Suicide Prevention Day was on Tuesday, and I confess I've had my own personal struggles. I am very good now. But LinkedIn has been full of messages of advice and just, I don't know, it's just been weird. And I've been triggered and pulled by various posts. And I've asked myself, are we really conquering this? In this video, maybe three minutes long, we'll lose four people on average across the world to a decision there whereby they've decided to check out. And this year's message is all about changing the narrative, start the conversation. And one particular message grabbed me this week, and I've never met it before, but it was written by Rose Rokins. And I'll put the message in this post. And it was talking about how to talk about suicide, saying something like, oh, they were so selfish. Instead, reflecting on the fact they were in so much pain. I'm wondering perhaps who you might be able to just check in on and make sure they are truly okay. Because it was one day on Tuesday, but it demonstrates that at the moment the numbers are increasing and we all need to club together to make sure that our brothers, sisters, friends, colleagues, fathers, mothers are all just okay. And if they're not, how do we sit with them and work on that? As Kobe Bryant says, life is not a straight line. And I certainly know from the dips comes growth. But sometimes you need to go through the dip to understand how grateful it is to rise. And leaving you with Kate's message that she left me with in terms of what I heard and what I saw. And I'll read it. Out of darkness can come light. So let that light shine bright. Have a great weekend.